Okay, Mike, here is the Tack Annie. T-A-C-K-A-N-N-I-E, Tack Annie. It's the third step in the Shim Sham. Okay, so you start with your feet apart. And what I want you to think about is lifting first. So lifting the right foot, spanking, which is a back brush, touching, making sure that you can see the crease in the shoe, lifting it back up and changing your weight. And as you change your weight, this foot lifts up and gets ready to go. Spank, touch, this foot lifts up. 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 Well, let's do four in a row with me. Five, six, here we go. Spank, touch, change. Spank, touch, change. Spank, touch, change. Spank, and then actually it changes here. The, the, what you do changes. So let's try that again. Lift up, then spank. Touch, change, spank, touch, change, spank, touch, change, and then you, you are going to do a spank, and then three steps. So then you go spank, one, two, three. Okay, so three tack ins. Tang version, FYI. Okay, so that is the tack Annie. It, it's usually a little faster. It usually goes di da da di da da di da da di da di da di da da. So what I want you to practice is uh, what I want you to practice is feet apart and practice lifting. So this is your right foot. Practice, I'm mirroring you. Practice lift. Lift, spank, touch, stamp. And you lift the other one at the same time. Spank, touch, stamp, lift. Spank, touch, lift. change your weight on the third sound, okay, and yes, you can change your weight. So, if we're doing it, we're going one, two, three, one, two, three. Okay, have fun practicing with you.